about Traincation that we had, I had with Rachel. Rachel mm -hmm. came here for three days and she wanted to train like me <laughs> <laughs> and have the whole, whole sort of um, pole, um, all the other trainings that I do and just a full experience. And now we're going to give you a little close-ups uh, what the traincation with Ona K was. So why, why did you come here? Well, I kind of just wanted to up my training game. Yeah, I need a new routine, a new regimen, especially when it comes to conditioning. Um, I want to get stronger and really push myself with different tricks and different ways to move dynamically. Mm -hmm. So I was like, well, Ona is definitely <laughs> the one to teach me <laughs> how to do these things. So yeah, I had a huge wish, wish list. Um, but yeah, just kind of overall encompassing, uh, yeah, trainings to help me get stronger, not just pull stuff. Because I don't do anything but pull, so I really wanted to mm -hmm. learn some things too. Yeah. Switch it up a bit. <laughs> and Rachel Tolzman is <laughs> from UK, but originally from US. So yes. You, you've been living in UK for um, three and a half years. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So... Um, how long have you been competing? Um, since 2016. Okay. So, so fresh new bird. Just a, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I right. I've only done, I counted them yesterday. I think I've only done seven comps so far. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. Yeah. So good. it's a good sort of, uh, I guess now you know your level in a yeah. way, what you can reach with yeah. what you have now. Yeah. And yeah. now it's like time to like upgrade the, the yeah. game. Exactly. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> I know that feeling. I, re I remember. <laughs> but um, yeah, so my idea was that I want to give about three trainings a day because she was here only for three days. So it's kind of like three days you can go full on. Fourth day you would basically have to take a day off, I guess. Mm -hmm. Maybe at least I would Some have rest. to. <laughs> yeah, but you, you had a little bit of a flu yeah. so yeah. that it didn't really but, we we got to do yeah, everything yeah, we but did, we did. you just weren't like 100 percent. yeah yeah but yeah i mean at least like what mattered most i got i got through really well like all the pole stuff yeah so but, yeah yeah so let's talk <laughs> about the pole stuff then <laughs> um rachel had specific um requests yeah. for pole that you can just um talk about a little later i'm gonna first um i i reviewed I'm, I want to tell, like, from my perspective, what I was thinking that I want to sort of do mm -hmm. with you. Mm -hmm. And, like, I was watching your videos, and I saw, so you have this great stamina for pole. You can go on, do tricks after tricks after mm -hmm. tricks. And I even saw your, like, performance with this, like, five or six minute piece <laughs> that you did for... Um, for that one uh, world competition okay. and so I could I could see like she has the tricks mm -hmm. she has basically the stamina now we would have to maybe upgrade some mm -hmm. of you mm -hmm. know get you some like Comments. new flips yeah. or new um, harder skills but also okay. sort of like Maybe just like what we were chatting about, yeah. like what is, what makes the difference yeah, in yeah. a competition routine? Like yeah. there are so many pole dancers that actually can bust out all the same moves, yeah. you know, yeah. they have the strength, they have the flexibility, but what makes you stand out? Mm -hmm. And like I told you, it's, it's definitely like, we're talking about contrast, mm -hmm. we're talking about risk taking, yeah. we're talking about um, just interesting elements. Mm -hmm. And this was something that I wanted to let Rachel know and that I'm also sort of like interested in uh, helping mm -hmm. you with your like upcoming mm -hmm. maybe competition routines because mm -hmm. I feel like you, you have all the potential. Mm -hmm. Now it's just a matter of how are we going to, you know, Sort of more like which um, elements are we really gonna choose, yeah, and which yeah. we're not gonna choose, you yeah. know? Yeah. So it's more like more we don't want to take everything. <clears throat> yeah. yeah, we wanna 
we want to find first of all a song that yeah. is really inspiring and then start sort of picking mm -hmm. what could be mm -hmm. like good for this particular routine mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so it's not like uh lots of times you see these like super talented <laughs> pole stars doing like the alphabets of pole mm -hmm. you see every single move yeah. you know they can do yeah. and it takes a little bit away the intensity and like yeah. the just the overall mood right right yeah mm -hmm. starting to look mechanical probably yeah. yeah but what were your specific requests let's go back to them um well all things is dynamic anything that requires like power from the legs and the hips so lots, lots mm -hmm. of flips bungees uh, well, cleaning them up and then going further with them. I, I yeah. mean, like, I was doing things I really, I didn't even realize I could be doing, so that was awesome. <laughs> we got a lot of new stuff. We, yeah, it was, yeah. I yeah. wasn't even sure if we can, like, keep on yeah, sort of yeah, upgrading, yeah. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. I was still like, okay, let's give it a try. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. going from Fonji 180 yeah. to suddenly 360. Yeah, that was exciting. I know, I feel like that is within my reach. Yes! And again, force it. <laughs> nice. And again, pa. Uh huh. Okay. Good. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, so I don't know. That feels really awesome to yeah. be able to do stuff like that and to then start to understand where that power comes from. And then, well, for me, it's it's having now the conditioning tools to achieve that because I can build upon all those little exercises we did before actually going for it and just. And just start from the beginning and then do and incorporate this into my daily practice right so that I can really get somewhere and get more power and mm -hmm. yeah power spins like you know linking some cool things together we mm -hmm. did as well yeah yeah um, something yeah. something cool something Fierce, fierceness fierce yeah factor. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Um, I basically, I gave, we build it up all the fungies okay. from scratch. Yeah. So we basically, we started fungies both sides, full fungies, not just up and down, but also down and up yeah. both sides. That was yeah a it's, little bit new for you. Well, surprisingly, well, yeah, it is semi, semi new. Um, and I only had practiced on the one side and when we yeah. did, when we did the other side I actually felt like surprisingly okay like yeah. even felt yeah. maybe a little bit better so. i remember yeah. seeing <laughs> that other side was stronger yeah and better yeah it came instantly like yeah yeah that was a nice surprise so. yeah so yeah and that happens actually with fungies uh -huh. it can the other other side can really surprise you mm -hmm. but you just have to you know keep doing them <laughs> <laughs> that's the only thing reps 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 yeah. both sides um yeah, yeah. But overall, I feel like you accomplished so much. Yeah, me too. Like, me too. In not many trainings, yeah. we were like, <laughs> what else did we do? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> like, nonstop. Yeah. Training it, every two hours. Yeah, exactly. It was like, hey, Rachel, let's go. <laughs> gymnastics is starting. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Well, okay, so yeah, we did gymnastics. Well, that we did today, and yeah. I was pretty tired by the well, because of the cold as well. Yeah, but I was pretty yeah. tired by them, but that was awesome. I mean, I loved that. I really yeah. would like to do that again. Yeah, that that instructor was pretty phenomenal. Yeah. Um, and then, uh, oh yeah, we did our wall bars here at home. Yep. I'm ready for you. Let's go. <laughs> Yep, wall bar condition. That was really helpful. I learned some new things to do at the studio, so mm -hmm. that's good. Um, oh yeah, training for warriors. True. That, that was, was. I mean, what do we do? Five minutes. <laughs> five minutes of war, yeah. which was fine. It was. It, <laughs> it was exhausting. I was proud yeah. of myself. I did a lot of a lot of Yeah, reps. yeah. We both did a lot. Yeah, of reps, I, I gotta say, yeah. I was not think. I wasn't sure if I can like. Yeah at the end of the day because yeah. of the wall bar conditioning and yeah, yeah. you know everything yeah. that was under it already I yeah. was like okay yeah, yeah. let's see what's gonna happen yeah. I, I liked those elements but like I don't know if like the yelling aspect is like my cup of tea yeah yeah it's like a lot too of people much, like, shouting and like yeah 
but it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> For me, a lot of people, like, complain about that in oh, a way. Okay. And I, I didn't like it in the beginning yeah. at all. Yeah. But little by little, I started using it as a, like, a motivational just yeah. thing. You know, you go there, you're in war, there's somebody like, come on, let's get going. <laughs> and I started thinking it as a positive thing. Yeah. So it started pushing me. Yeah. And it's only there, you know. It's not like, hola, omelette. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> so it's it's only there in a way. Yeah. And I try to, you know. Yeah, you know, you utilize it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Uh, good. we made it. We made it. I felt like the end was just really easy. Yeah. All those, well, all yeah, those after animals. that war, <laughs> after that war, those, a little bit those crunches was, felt okay. Yeah. Um, ice bathing. Oh, that yeah. was your biggest dream. I know, I know. I was so sad. <laughs> Like, maybe it's not smart to go in the water when you're yeah. having a head cold. But but yeah, it's so not. I- it's not. So, <laughs> Rachel couldn't go. Yeah. But as a trooper, I went and, and I showed. Watched, I watched. <laughs> <laughs> so, we have the sort of almost experience. Now, she knows what to expect when she comes back. Yes, yes. <laughs> she does it like a pro. I mean, you should see her. Just, like, just goes in and, like, and then just, like, sits there calmly. <laughs> Like, and then after two minutes, oh, it starts to feel really good. <laughs> <laughs> Hypothermia <laughs> hits. Oh, my God, it's so the warm. The first part is horrible, but then yeah. I could stay in here all day. Yeah. I think those were your words. Your exact Most words. likely. <laughs> sounds sounds fami- familiar. Yeah, that's um, cool. We did also a little bit of a spinal waves yeah. that I've been... Um, because I have taken this, like, John Ewan's online training. Yep. And I have tried to, like sort of get the spinal waves yeah. happening in yeah. each well not almost every day yeah. almost yeah. every i would say training session mm. i would want to take care of the spine uh-huh. and we did a little bit of that yeah, and of like course the lot. breathing nice. exercises yeah. so mm-hmm. do you feel like that was weird no i i liked the breathing exercises i mean i've i've done like other types of breathing exercises yeah. just because of singing as well. And, oh, yeah, of and, course. And, and, and yeah. We didn't do any singing. <laughs> <sighs> well, you did a little bit. You I did. Some finished folk songs for me. I did a little that showcase. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, now well, when you go home, yeah. you can then yeah. sit in this kind of position, yeah. maybe. Yeah. And then. <sighs> I, I liked it. It was good. <laughs> I, can't, I think a lot I of understand spit the everywhere of it as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But that yeah. Tingly, tingly sensation, the awakening of the body. It's yeah. yeah. It was really quite interesting. It's nice, cool. What about what about the food? Did you like our yes. little restaurants? Yes, <laughs> you guys are wonderful cooks. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, for me, well, okay, so. Students ask me all the time, like, what do I eat, you know? Right. And, um, yeah, everybody always wants to know. I think it's, like, a really personal thing. Like, you can't yeah. really tell anyone what they should be No, it's true. Either, you know, yeah. like, um... And you shouldn't but, be asking, in a way. Like, yeah, yeah. of course you can ask, but yeah, still yeah, yeah. you need to understand, like, what are the what differences for your body, and... Yeah. yeah, and what, how active you are during course, the day. I mean, of it all kind of depends, yeah. so... But for me, like, what was different um, is that I felt like you, you guys don't, like, eat any carbs. <laughs> I mean, barely any, and I, I, I do eat carbs. I mean, not like a massive amount, but like I'll have yogurt and muesli in the morning, yeah. but you guys have banana eggs and it's just eggs and bananas blended up basically. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, I mean, I guess you get a little carbs from the fruit, you know, but, yeah. um, but yeah. And then like lots of protein, which is good. I'm all for that as well. Yeah. You know, it was, yeah. yeah, it felt really clean and healthy and we had this really nice pizza. Oh, I love that pizza. Yeah, I dream really about that pizza. Interesting crust, but yeah. it worked. <laughs> I was like, okay. Yeah. So like, the, yeah, the, the, the base of the pizza is just egg whites. Yeah. I mean. And olive oil and salt. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Meringue crust. Exactly. <laughs> Meringue without sugar. Yeah. <laughs> Just a yeah. little bit of a salt. <laughs> but it's actually pretty good. But I have to say, like, that evening, then, like, two hours later, I was hungry. I yeah. was like... Okay. You know, so then yeah. I was like, okay, well, hmm, that's interesting. You yeah. Because I felt like I ate a lot of dinner. Yeah, yeah. And there was and a then, lot on the pizza, mm-hmm. but it was like, maybe that's yeah. why maybe I need I was actually more, hungry, too, after carbs, that. You know? <laughs> yeah. Something a bit more. Yeah, true. But, but we're training so much, like these past. No, nah, it's like, so different. Weeks. We haven't so. even like I haven't not been training this much uh-huh. 
with whatever I've been eating like. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I would say like I would have needed maybe at least like a risotto every evening yeah. or something, you know, like yeah. mashed potatoes or really yeah. like Yeah. But I feel like yeah, the carbs come like I I, I people often think like yeah. okay, carbs, pasta, potato, yeah. you know, yeah. wheat, you know, it's like and I feel like there's so many other other things, other that, things that you can eat yeah. and get <clears throat> get enough right. i would say enough of uh of carbs of course yeah. you need to eat a massive amount of veggies but yeah. we do eat yeah, yeah. a lot okay. yeah. so yeah i feel like and i would say like five days a week we would eat like that and then you yeah. know you can stack up the pasta maybe <laughs> two days a yeah. week yeah. and again you feel like super full yeah, you then, then. Mm. yeah yeah so but, oh i forgot the jogging we did some jogging too oh my god can, that's right yeah. Let's talk about that. It was great. Oh, oh I had fun. So let's go back to <laughs> one training session we had, and we're like, okay, let's go jog. And me, you know, thinking like, I've been become so good at jogging, and boom, Rachel starts already. Like I'm like, damn, Oscari, let's go. So my boyfriend Oscari was jogging with us too, and I was like, oh shit, I didn't know Rachel can actually jog. <laughs> Like, I'm an acrobat who has been jogging now a little, getting a little, you know, small little improvements, and then yeah. you come and boom, I'm like, Rachel, wait, wait. That was oh, funny. It was good, it was good. That we, was you were good. Yeah. yeah we I feel like it. so much, you know, the amount of upper body we're doing, yeah. I feel like the jogging is like, was, I hate it every time, yeah. in a way, but I feel like if I want to stay in balance with yeah. my body, yeah. And also recovery wise, oh, it's yeah. great. Yeah, I, agree. I mean, how much yeah. it warms the yeah. entire body and yeah. gives this like relaxing yeah. little bounce. And yeah, even not doing the uh, little jogging in place at the training for warriors last night. Yeah, like, that yeah. Hurt my shoulder so much oh today. Oh my god! It's like, like oh, yeah. okay. It's kind of yeah. like buttering up your like yeah. uh, putting a little yeah. oil. Yeah. So that was nice. Yeah. It's good to discover. Yeah. True. Right. Um, <laughs> We did take you to my favorite coffee place too. Yes, that was. Wonderful. Did we like it? I loved it. I'm bringing some coffee home. Coffee roastery. Again, we have Spot just on. fans, fans <laughs> from all over the world. Every time, all they do talk about is coffee roastery. <laughs> it was delicious. Yeah, they roast their own coffee there. So yeah, how can you go wrong? Yeah. No. Exactly. Yeah. True. So. Okay. We have uh, basically come to an end. I yeah. thought I want to yeah. do something nice for Rachel and take her <laughs> to a warm pool. <laughs> Everybody's always like, oh my God, oh, you always have to go to these like cold pools. But this yeah. time we're going to go to Ala Sea Pool, which is basically like a, like a place to swim and go to sauna, mm -hmm. but outside. Yeah. And uh, so again, you know, th there's always a cold aspect yeah, yeah. if you come yeah. <laughs> somewhere with me. So, um, but it's on the market square, right in the center of Helsinki. You know, you see the sea, you see the cruise boats, you see actually yeah. the presidential house right there in front of you. Yeah. And you can just, yeah. So, yeah, I want nice. to It's a nice you. partying, partying Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are you going to come back? Yeah, definitely. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Be like, yeah, you know, when you see somebody is like, uh, you know, you're coming back. Yeah, of course I am. Never. No, no, I, I am. I am definitely. Yeah. Maybe also during the summer. Yeah. I mean, the, to be honest, this weather was beautiful. We had sun every single day. It was cold. Like, yeah. This is spring for you guys, but this is still winter for me. I mean, I've learned I one thing this trip. It is that Finnish people like it cold. Yeah. You, you I, I'm not sure if we even do like cold. it. We we just have to tolerate. live it. We have <laughs> yeah. I would say we tolerate, but uh, I I wouldn't necessarily uh, say that Finnish people would like the okay. cold. Like if you look at these people's Instagrams, they're all the time just talking about like, oh, I'm so fed up with this winter. <laughs> like dreaming of Mexico. Oh okay. Well, but, but then again, you are not the only one ice bathing. Like, there were so many people going That's in the water, and I'm like... That one guy. This is, like, hardcore diving headfirst in and, like, staying under for, like, 20 <laughs> seconds. I was like, I thought the guy died, yeah. and now, like... <laughs> it was impressive. Like, okay, this is how they do it here. 
This is how they do it. This is how we do it. Yeah. So basically, <coughs> now you know a little bit how it looks like training with me on a K. And this was actually the first traincation that we had that oh. a person comes to the house, really? lives at our house, does all the trainings. Oh. Like, of course, I've had, like, yeah. you know, friends over do yeah. this, but this was, like, an actual traincation with Ona K. Wow. <laughs> I'm honored to be the first. Yeah. So. You did good. Thanks. So, thank you for watching. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Kitos. Kitos. Kitos.